Hi, today we will integrate Angular material into our Angular 19 project. Then we will create a toolbar and a side navigation with a burger animation. So let's get started. Uh, I'm on this mat Angular material website. I will click on get started. You can integrate Angular material by this schematic called Angular material. So you just add this command here and we will be asked a couple of questions first is like which theme do you want to go with uh, you can see there are different themes here you can choose out of these four by default or you can go with custom i would go with this green one cyan one color so cyan and orange so let me select it next question is about typography so yes i would like typography and animation i would like that Let's see what changes when we select these options in our project. First thing, there will be two packages added called Angular CDK and Material with a version 19. Since we said we want to have material a typography, the fonts has been imported into index.html. By default, it's Roboto. And you can see the same font should be mentioned into our body, like Roboto, Hel Helvetica, and Sans Serif. And in the app routing, uh, app config, we have the animation because we said we would like to have animation. So these are the basic changes. Uh, without any further changes, you can see the output has changed, the font has changed here. Okay, so let's start with our menu bar. So let me go to component and I will go for a toolbar. I can find it, it's easily here. Toolbar is here. So I need this simple toolbar. Let me copy the code from here, HTML code. Let me go to my HTML, replace it here. I would like to make it a bit smaller so that I can see the window here. And I need to input the modules for the HTML part. So I would go ahead and copy paste the material modules and I will import into my component. So, okay. So I have it imported here with that. I should have a basic map here, but the style is missing. So let me copy the style, come back here, put style here, and we should have a nice styling here. Uh, I would just take out these two buttons and have only one. So I would take out favorite button and I would use something called logout so that it looks like logout with this my app I would say this is learning angular so that is learning angular and I would like to have some background color for my toolbar so let me put a background color mm, it's okay that's fine then I would like to have a sidebar when I click on this burger icon I would like to see a sidebar so let me go back to components and in the list I would pick up side navigation and I would like to have something like this so let me take the code from HTML go to my HTML put it here we need some import so we already have button so I will just take the side navigation Put a side navigation in my import array and that should give me the drawer and some fill, the default button here so with that we should have a toggle which looks a bit weird because we need a style so let's go and take a style from the documentation put it here and we have something better looking Let's try to make it a bit smaller again and arrange it like this. Okay. Uh, let's make its height 100% instead of 300 so that and I would like to remove this toggle border. And we can do is we can add a background color for the side now. So where is side now? This is side now. So let's add a background color to that. Uh, it's too 
so width is bit smaller so we got a bit smaller here and we can do something like on this burger click i would like to close and open this one so instead of having this button here i will delete this toggle button yeah, content is fine and on the burger menu i will put this event so now if i click on this burger menu it will open and close next is maybe we can have this kind of new feature again like if you open this and if you click on the content it should close this one so let's add this feature and that should be it for our video so i will just say draw.close you open it you close it you open close you can go ahead and add something like instead of having this default text you can add a list here uh, let me go to the list i will just copy this list here and those will be your some route pages for example uh, not this one i just need this module it would be like list module copy and in the html i would say something like users i can say post i can say to do's and with this you should have your menus you can have some divider just to look a bit nicer i, I can just self close it right. and this looks like nice right so this is our simple angular application with a menu and a material design thank you